Okay, today what we're doing is going to install a 360 emulator on a PC. Now, no bullshit, I got it to work. Um, you can do it if, as long as your PC is up to the task, you'd be alright. So what you need to do first is type Python 2.7 and download Python 2.7 from its site. You're going to need this for your runtime. Also, you're going to need Visual Studio from Microsoft, so type Visual Studio, click the Visual Studio and download that as well, which is community. Um, I'm just downloading it here. If you can see that, still downloading that. But it's still working. It wasn't working at all without this. Okay, what else you're going to need is the emulator itself, so if you go to Emu Crimson Rain uh, scroll down to page 3 I think it is and you'll find it there see in the git click more you can get a list of sites but I got it from Mega I've already downloaded it and you'll come up with it here if you do extract it to the folder which is here Now, what you have is you'll have the um, CMU Xena page and you'll have the Xena icon here. But when you first run this, it probably won't work because it needs deals or DLL files. And let's just show you this. Um, if you need a deal file, which would be msvcp140.dll, and VC runtime 140.dll. Um, when it first loads, it will come up with where missing. What we do is you go to this site, you type in your missing deal here, and when you typed it in, you'll get where the deals. You click that, you can come down and fix it for free on this side. Uh, you need the 32 bit version. When you've downloaded it, you'll see what I've had to get all the deal files here. And what you do is click them open. And you take your deal file here and you stick it into your emulator folder here. Basically what would happen is it will say these files are missing and it's because the um, Python and virtual runtime was not installed when I first tested this. But now I've installed it, obviously it's put the files in, as you can see it's installed in here. So it probably supplied the studio files what I needed already. So let's get going. Um, what you do is you right click your Xena, you run as administrator, click yes to that. Now what will happen is it will open the emulator itself and it will say select a content package. Now this is a content package means select a game. Now I've got some games which I backed up personally from my own natural collection onto my Xbox. None of these are downloaded, these are all backed up. Um, I've just been testing them and I know what Death Smile works. So select Death Smile. You're going to need the big one at 7.2 gig, not the small Q file. You need the big one. Click that. And there we go. It's working. Been playing around with this today to see what would work and what wouldn't. Now, amazingly, this emulator. Okay, what you got now is you press the button. Just to show this is in a PC.
I've got to be placed one handed. It's not really about playing the game, but. Right, just going to, going to show what it is an MLO and not a trick. Um, it's got all the different timings and stuff. Your window. Go for full screen. And left and left and take it back. Can see what the Visual Studio's been installed as well. The emulator option, what I was showing you. Screen. Let's try one more game for you. Exit. Some just played the demo apparently, some played the whole game. Some are playable totally, some have errors, but this is really good work. Press A and it's froze. Okay, let's try another one. A heavy emulator and um, it probably won't work on all systems. But you do need those DIL files and you do need the Python and the Visual Studio runtime for Microsoft to even attempt to run it. Okay, good luck. Hope you enjoyed the video. See you all again in the next one.